Welcome back to Candy's Classic Game Shrine, everyone. And today's video is a state of the channel sort of video to let you all know what's going on with the channel and what will be going on with the channel. Uh, last night, late last night, I got an email from YouTube basically saying, go fuck yourself, your channel is too small and shitty for us to want to give a shit about paying you for it. So, in other words, come February, me and many other channels who are under a thousand subscribers and four thousand hours of view time are going to be losing monetization and being kicked off our MCNs <clears throat> and basically doing this shit for free. Um, I don't have a problem with that. This is more of a hobby than it is a job for me. I have a real job. Um, not saying that people that do YouTube full-time don't have real jobs, because far from the truth. This is more of a hobby for me. Um, however, that doesn't excuse the fact that I'm pissed off that YouTube thought that this was the solution to the Logan Paul situation and his bullshit excuse of an existence on the planet and on the platform. Uh, basically, instead of punishing those that abuse the system, YouTube finds it easier just to shit on the little people and just continuing to rake in the money and views with these assholes continuing to abuse the platform. Because people like Logan Paul and PewDiePie aren't going to get reprimanded seriously over the bullshit that they do. It's anyone underneath that's going to get stepped on and shat on. So, what does that mean for the channel? Nothing for the viewers. I'm still going to upload my content. Nothing's really going to change. Um, this is my passion. Video gaming is my passion. Sharing it with everybody is fun. It's a nice way of engaging with people who have a similar passion with me and sharing my knowledge and my bullshit stories with everyone. How is that going to change for me? Um, well, I'm not going to have as much money to throw around on the channel. The money that I made from my channel, I threw right back into my channel, whether it was purchasing things to, uh, to review, purchasing things to fix, purchasing things to customize, uh, purchasing better microphones, um, <clears throat> things like that. So the money that I had, or the extra money that I had, that I would dump right back into the channel, is not really going to be there anymore. Most of my paycheck is going to go towards bills, mostly medical bills, and other bullshit like that. Um, another way that's going to change for me, though, is the gloves are off. Fuck YouTube, fuck their algorithm, fuck their bots, fuck the demonetization, fuck the controversy, fuck the drama, fuck having to filter myself, fuck everything. You're gonna get me unfiltered the way that I truly want to be, which means more fucking cursing because that's the way that I fucking am. So, I guess it gives me a bit more creative freedom now. Now that I don't have to tiptoe around losing my money since gonna be lost anyway so I guess um, <clears throat> it's a bit of a double-edged sword uh, it sucked because I enjoyed getting the money to put into the channel to then provide content for people but hey to quote trailer park boys that's the fucking way she goes um, is it the end of the world no I'll still add to my collection, it'll probably just be at a much slower pace, and the content I will still put out for everyone, <clears throat> especially my Virtual Boy series, um, I've been going around and revo uh, bleh, reviewing all of the uh, officially released Virtual Boy games, and I've dubbed that series Adventures in the Third Dimension, and it seems to be doing really well, and you know what? I'm really happy that it is. It's YouTube's loss that they're not going to be able to make money off of it. And fuck them. I guess that's uh, that's what Patreon is for if anyone wants to donate. I've had one. The links are always in the description to the videos that I make. But I never pressure it on anyone because this is a hobby channel. 
<clears throat> and I understand I'm a small channel and not that many people have money to spare. So by all means, do I not expect anyone to give me any money? Um, what I would like, how you can help me during all this bullshit, uh, you can like my videos, uh, comment on my videos, hell, you can even dislike my videos, any engagement is good engagement in the eyes of YouTube. Um, share my videos, share my channel if you genuinely like my stuff. Um, you can follow me on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook. I'm going to possibly be looking into Twitch as well. I'm not m not really a streamer, but I can totally get into it. Um, let's see what else. Let's see, the Virtual Boy series is doing well. YouTube is a piece of shit. My channel's been growing pretty steadily, and you know what? I want to take a moment out of all this bullshit to say thank you, genuinely thank you to everybody that likes, who has subscribed, commented, and just watches my videos. It helps a lot. Makes me, uh, makes me know that what I'm doing is enjoyed by people. And, uh, yeah. Sorry guys, I, I usually script things and <clears throat> this coming at me couldn't have happened at a more crazy time because on top of my channel being demonetized next month, I may not even be living on the East Coast next month. Um, I might be moving over to Seattle. Fuck me. Um, yeah. So this, this game shrine, um, may not be much longer, at least in its current state, literally and geographically. But, uh... That, that's been on my mind a lot lately. <laughs> so, it's just been a lot on my plate all at once. But you know what, guys? If anything, when I'm pissed off, I tend to be motivated much more. And YouTube has pissed me off pretty good. Pretty fucking good. So, yeah. Expect more off-the-cuff, less filtered content from me from now on. And, uh, yeah. Let's break it down for you. I will put a note in the video because I'm sure this is going to be rambling on. This will be the TLDR, too long, didn't read, didn't watch notes. What's changing? I'm being demonetized next month. You don't have to do anything. Nothing changes for the viewers. I'm still going to put out content. You can donate to Patreon if you would like to. By no means are you obligated. I would like to ask my viewers to like, comment, subscribe, uh, dislike if you don't like the video. Um, just engage in my channel and help spread the word if you genuinely enjoy. And uh, keep a lookout for Adventures in the Third Dimension. There's a lot of Virtual Boy content coming this year. Despite all the bullshit, we are going to have a good virtual view year. View as in V-U-E, the code for the, uh, the Virtual Boy. Um, I don't want to ramble on too much. Um, I feel like I've repeated myself a bunch of times. I have a few other important videos to keep on the lookout for. I have a uh, Team Meat, the makers of Super Meat Boy, um, and a bunch of other games. They're fucking awesome people. They were, despite YouTube not thinking that my channel is not good enough to create content, uh, Team Meat actually thought my channel was good enough to create content and to promote their content. So they supplied me with a review code for Super Meat Boy on the Switch. Um, I'm in the middle of playing the game over again. I've bought it on every console and platform it's ever come out on. So I'm just playing through it again. And uh, I'll have a review out hopefully next week of that. And then after that video, I have a video where I want to talk about mental health and video games. So... Keep an eye out for those, and you know what, guys? 
if you're struggling through this YouTube bullshit too and your channel is under a thousand subscribers, link your channel in the comments below and I will do my best to support you guys as well by liking, watching your content, and everything else. It's by working together that we're all going to get through this. I know a lot of people are going to be upset. Fuck, I'm upset too. But you know what? We should take this moment to take YouTube's words and fucking throw it right back in their faces with a bit of fuck you into, like, included. <clears throat> so many of us work our asses off, whether it's just for a hobby channel or to genuinely, as an income for some people. Our channels may not be big, but we all deserve the recognition and we all deserve the time. So with that said, guys, take care.